authentic Jamaican Aki and Saltfish guys if you have not subscribed this is the time to do so this is the beginning of the Jamaican Aki series where I am going to show you how to make hi guys welcome back to my channel today is Aki and the Saltfish day also the first episode in the Jamaican Aki series where I will show you some delicious Aki recipes. I will try to cover all of the ways in which we Jamaicans enjoy our Aki. So let's get ready to prepare our national salsa. Guys, we are now removing our Aki from the pad. Now we have removed them from the pad. Now it's time to pluck the seed from it. And this is what we have. And guys, I never use knife to pluck my ackee seed because let me show you what happened when you use a knife. If you have to cut in the ackee like that, you literally cut out the seed and then you're wasting all this goodness why 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 you do not want to do that so instead I just put my finger right in that little groove there squeeze out the seed and then you just take out the little thing and see you have all of your aki you understand this is how it's done yes guys so after you are finished picking your aki give it a quick rinse off and put it in a pot with boiling water never put your aki in cold water don't ask me why i've never tried it but this always works for me so just put your aki in some boiling water please and thank you and meanwhile doing that you should have put a piece of salt fish in some water let it soak for a good half an hour then we are going to put it in the pot with the aki and just leave it to cook until the aki is cooked this will help to flavor the aki and of course you should not put any salt in the pot with the aki because the salt fish is salt and that is going to boil out that is all the salt you need all right so guys, 10 minutes has passed, my aki is cooked, now I'm straining it off, now get some cold water and put your salt fish in. Get another container with cold water. Now we are going to pick it up. Put it in that water there. So any salt that is trapped inside the inside the salt pit can be washed out in this water here. Because even though you boil it. The, 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 you have some excess salt that is trapped inside sometimes and then when you pick it up and cook it with your aki now then your aki becomes salt so you want to remove as much salt as you can so this is your salt dish just put this aside until you are ready to use it this, this is what I'm going to use to cook up my ackee and salt fish. I have some tomato, some red, green and gold sweet pepper, some white onion and hot pepper. I'm going to add some dry thyme to this, some thyme leaves. Get everything in there. Before they are cooked, you need to drain your salt fish 
and for the people who are who are using um can aki this is the part where you should pay attention the secret to getting the best aki and salt fish you need to put in your salt fish to cook let the salt fish fry up with your seasoning so that the flavor of the salt fish can just come out nicely in the ackee some people cook in the ackee and salt fish and they just um put in the, the ackee put in the salt fish with the ackee no no you don't do it like that this right here is the perfect ackee and salt fish you put it in and let the salt fish fry up with the, with the seed. So by the time you are ready to put in your aki, all the salt fish flavor is just popping. Now it's time for the aki. Now I'm going to add a little black pepper. And a little um, all-purpose seasoning you don't have to put any of these in it but I love my food spicy so I do it then you just go ahead and gently fold your acne gently mix it you don't want to handle it too rough authentic jamaican aki and salt fish guys if you have not subscribed this is the time to do so this is the beginning of the jamaican aki series where i am going to show you how to make some delicious aki recipes aki mixed with everything look out for that people subscribe like and share thank you for being a superb fan.